Um, yeah, overall, um, I've worked FIFO for 25 years or so. As a supervisor, I was on, I had an option of two different um, fly-in, fly-out schedules. Now, I chose the 11 and 3 because I was home every second weekend. So that made it a, a bit easier to handle than what I'd, ex I'd experienced previously. And there was lots of people that I spoke to basically said, how come they can do it for you, but they can't look after the workers? They were the ones that were having to endure 28 days on and seven days off with losing one of the seven days off due to travel, both up there and back again. When they got home, they were that tired that they basically sort of slept the first day and then they tried to sort of integrate back into their families again. There was that early sort of depression thing and um, they found it difficult and in some instances, um, you know, some of the boys just um, took their own lives. People that are feeling a little bit vulnerable, they've got a 24-hour um, um, day helpline that's available, but I don't think that message gets out to the blokes on the ground. Um, or maybe it does get out there and they just go, oh, well, that's just the, the boss is just trying to please us, you know, and we want shorter working time out in the bush, and this is their way of trying to keep us out there. All the money in the world doesn't make up for being away from your family.